Yo, Iron Farm, let's go. I've got another design for you guys. This one is early game friendly. So if you want to build this right away, after you mine redstone, you can. Because this doesn't require too much resources. And the only expensive part here is the golden or the powered rail. This farm can produce 360 iron ingots per hour or 40 iron blocks per hour or more. Yeah. <laughs> These are the things that you need to build this thing. A lot of blocks, a lot of 20 blocks, a lot of slabs, 2 redstone blocks, 23 ladders, 1 oak trap door, 11 are what's this? Rail, 2 golden or powered rail, 3 beds, 3 any job site block. Then 8 oak fence gates, um, 48 carpets, water of a minecart, a barrel hopper, 3 oak sign, and 3 cobblestone wall. This can be any type of wood and this can be any type of stone. And an name tag. This is how my iron farm works. Mr. Alfred over here is carrying the villagers and he cycles around the um, villager cell. Now, these villagers is getting panicked, so they're like, no, 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 please help, need iron golem, they will, the iron golem will spawn here in this water over here, then it will drop to this killing chamber here and will be killed by lava, and its iron, or iron ingot will be collected here, to this barrel over here. The tutorial will start in 3, 2, 1. First step is to make a 5x5 five five frame. Now make a 9x9 nine nine frame. Now build 3 block tall pillars in each of the corners of the frames. Now connect all of the pillars together like this. Now at the top, do something like this. Cover this um, gap here with stone slabs. After that, cover the roof with carpets. Now put glasses underneath or on the floor. Like so. And also here. Also the roof. Now place beds and your job site of your choice and the job site will be acceptable in this farm now cover this with glass and at this part you put glasses like that leave these two here okay i'm gonna do a color coding in this video so black stained glass is for literal glass you cannot replace it with other blocks and the white stained glass can be replaced with any other block of your choice so I replaced the glasses on the floor with black stained glass. So this represents the literal glass and the white stained glass represents the block of your choice. Now let's cover this area up. Now go inside of the cell, then try to put a block here. Then a, stone, a smooth stone slab like so then build something like this all the way here like that there now from here put a redstone block there part rail then rail part rail then put water here if i can reach to the water like so now come five blocks in each corner like so five five one two three four five yeah now fill it all in now in the villager cell break the bed temporarily and dig in the middle three blocks below then you're gonna count four on each side and you're gonna clear them all up and you will end up with a nine by nine by three area and next is put water sources on each corner and now you're gonna put fence gates like this and open them all up so this is where the golems will spawn and they will fall down to the pit. And now from this point you're gonna dig 20 blocks below. And you're gonna put ladders all the way up and a 
chapter at the end. And now go back to the bottom and clear 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 blocks. And now from this area, you're gonna dig this 3 by 3 area up until you see this tunnel. Now put your barrel over here and feed a hopper onto it. Then dig these blocks and put water sources on it. Then dig these blocks and grab your capsule wall and do something like this. Then your oxide like this, like so and like so. No, like so. Then put your lava here and a sign over here. And that is your killing chamber done. Now go back to the killing chamber and put the glass back and your bed back. 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 Now get a minecart and a name tag named sub to insanity and do whatever the name tag tells you to do. Because if you don't, the farm will not work. And drag a zombie into the water channel and name him and put a minecart on the rail. Now the last and the most important part of the farm, chuck 3 villagers inside the villager cell. And that is your farm done. Now let the villagers sleep and work so they can now start producing some iron golems. There you have it guys, that is the simplest iron farm I can think of. And I'm 24 subscribers away from 100, so please subscribe. Anyway, that's all. Like, share, subscribe, and thanks. Bye!